What's up, everybody? We got some more e Jesus to review. Um, this time they're from dndvapor.com, and uh, what we got here is their chocolate fudge brownie, chocolate dip strawberry, frosted spice cake, winter chill, and the la chee flavor. Let's start off with my favorite at the bunch. That's the um, chocolate fudge brownie. Let's see how it smells. It smells really, really good. Just like a fresh out the oven chocolate brownie. Um, I could just drink this right now. It smells so good. Um, when I vape it, it's just got these exquisite chocolate fudge brownie notes to it that just it sets it off. It's probably the most realistic tasting chocolate fudge brownie I've ever vaped from any vendor. I've tried a bunch of them and they always seem to have the chocolate taste kind of off. This right here, it tastes real. It tastes spot on. Probably the best chocolate fudge brownie flavor I've ever come across, period. Um, when I vape it, it's just got just such a rich and chocolatey, fudgy kind of brownie taste to it. It's it's unbelievable. Um, definitely going to go get me a couple big bottles of this. It's going to be in my all-day vape for a while. Can't get enough of this stuff. Um, definitely recommend it if you're a fan of kind of like a Hershey bar, chocolate, uh, fudgy, brownie kind of vape. It's dead on, spot on. It's pretty sweet too. It's about an 8 on a scale of sweetness, 1 to 10, but it's not too sweet. It's, it's perfect. Now, the chocolate dip strawberry. This is a very, very unique juice. Um, I don't know how they did it, but let's see how it smells first. Now, let's smell the chocolate, mostly strawberry smell. When I vape it though, it's, it's, it's so weird how it, how it works. Like, on the inhale, it's just like you've bitten into a chocolate covered strawberry. On the exhale, it's like when you're actually chewing up the chocolate covered strawberry. So on the inhale, you get mostly a, a chocolate strawberry kind of taste. And the exhale, you get more of a, a realistic strawberry taste. It's just, it's a, a one hell of a flavor. If you're a fan of chocolate dipped strawberries, you need to go check this one out. Um, now the frosted spice cake, not really a fan of this one. Um, Let's see how it smells. It smells kind of like an unsweetened um, spice cake. And that's what I'm pretty much getting when I vape it. I know it says frosted spice cake. I'm not really tasting the frosting there. I'm not really tasting any sweetness at all, really. I mean, to me, for this to be good, it needs to have a lot more sweetener added to it. Um, when I vape it, I'm tasting the spice cake, kind of like a maybe a carrot cake kind of taste to it. Um, it's about a 4 on a scale of the 1 to 10 sweetness, though, which is kind of odd to me being that it's like a frosted spice cake. I expected it to taste kind of sweet, but it's really not. Most of the main flavor you're going to get is just this spicy kind of yellow cake taste that's really not sweet at all. I mean, so not good enough for me to be an all day vape, but um, if you like a spice cake that really isn't sweet at all, then you probably like it. Um, now the winter chill. Let's see how this one smells. It smells straight up like a raw piece of mint. Like, um, when I vape it, it's just like I popped one of them pieces of chewing gum in your mouth that has some ice crystals in it that just freezes your whole mouth. That's kind of how it is when I vape it. When I vape it, it just, it's, it puts this lingering, frosty, icy, um, menthol flavor in your mouth that just lingers for a while it's that strong it's probably the strongest menthol vape I've ever come across um, wouldn't recommend it if you're not a fan of mini menthol but if you're you're seeking a one hell of a power packed menthol vape then you definitely need to go for this one it's just it's really really strong too strong for me to vape on it constantly but um I can see people that like menthol loving this. It's just it's identical to chewing on one of them um, ice crystal chewing gums. Now the uh, la chi. This is supposed to be like a Chinese fruit, if I'm not mistaken. It's um like a del delicacy over there. Let's see how it smells. Really an odd smelling fruit flavor. It's um it kind of smells like a pear. And an apple and a grape all in one. When I vape it, it's it's, it's a really unique fruit flavor. I've never um, vaped or really ate a fruit 
it tastes like this. It's um, my best description of it would be it has notes of grapes, like green grapes, um, notes of like a yellow apple, and pears in there. It's just like all three of those mixed together into one. Um, it's not a bad vape. It's just um, a really unique um, kind of fruity flavor. Um, I, it's really kind of hard to explain. My best explanation for it is just a, a grape mixed with an apple mixed with a pear. So um, if that sounds good to you, go try it out. I got all five of these from dndvapor.com. And um, I'll give you a link in the description like always so you can go check them out. Right now, I think they're just selling e-juice, but um, so far the e-juice I've tried from them is um, it's, it's high quality and the prices is pretty cheap. So um, head on over and check out their lineup. They they don't have many um, flavors to choose from right now, but they're constantly adding more. So um, that's something to look out for. Thanks for watching my review. And vape on.